295 a gallon. Nine gallons. Shooting around Muncie and general area of Indiana. Guess we're full. 9.3 gallons. Well, what do we got here for fuel miles? Take off my mandatory glove. And what do we got here? 128 divided by 9.75 looks like 13 miles per gallon. Yep, that's all they get. Where are we? Portland, just about to cross state line into Ohio, and the price of fuel will probably go up. Hmm. Bush hog. I'm still in Indiana. Just checking out this little machine here. <laughs> Mud tires. One belt runs the pumps and one belt hmm, runs the blades. One big belt. Take a little peek. Yep. Big belt. I'd like one belt to run the center blade and another belt to run to the outside blades. Push hog. 0.6 hours. Looks like it's been sitting outside for a long time. Custom made parts. Never heard of this brand before. Reinforced. Whoosh. A little alignment problem here. That pulley is too high. Look at the belt coming off the engine, the crankshaft. It's riding uphill. There's something wrong with that bracket that runs that left side. I wonder why the belt's running so high. Do it know. Don't know. Somebody screwed up assembling it. Kohler, probably a 27 horsepower. Nope, 30 horsepower. Mine's a 27. Alright, back in the t -Ruck. Just wanted to see what these machines were. Old fire truck. Riot Fire Department. That guy's chugging along. Lots of farm equipment here. We're almost at the state line on the way to Salina. Lots of good farming equipment. Wow, John Deere International. Bryant Combine Parts. Fully equipped. Lots of machinery. Don't know why it's not being used though. You'd think they'd want to use it. Wouldn't you? Hot rods, good home cooking. At Jimmy's Cafe. Paperwork here. Just crank this baby up. Oh yeah. What the crap is that? Satellite radio. And we're off. Hot rods. Jenny's home. Uh oh. Dead. Wow, look at all the combines. Whole field of really expensive equipment sitting in high. Doesn't look too good. Oh, 
Turning right. 63 Pontiac. Yeah. There's an old service station. The good old equipment. Uh oh. Road closed. Local traffic only. Now what? Question. What do we do now? Uh oh. Here we go. Some gentleman on a Honda six cylinder. Help me turn there and we're taking a country road detour. I didn't see any signs, but I was too busy making videos. I'm digging a ditch. Clean those ditches out. Rural Indiana. You gotta love it. We don't need no stinking interstate. The Hindi Buggy Shop. Following the man on the Honda. He'll take us where we want to go. He's a good man. Famous gathering in Indiana. Camera's slow to interpret my button, but they got a windmill powered water well and I'm pressing the friggin' buttons and this camera's slow, slow, slow. We're on the rough roads here, there's a big shed. the Amish live. Simple, no electricity maybe. Living off the land. That's good. So we're going to cut back subsidies to fossil fuels. I mean, we're going to cut the, the coal subsidies. The detour! <laughs> Back on the road, thanks to a gentleman on a Honda motorcycle. Beautiful Indiana land. Just about ready. We're, we're over here. Just we're ready to cross over into Ohio. I'll show you. I got a new purple camera right there. Look at this. We're in the middle of nowhere. Trinity, Ohio. They have the most beautiful brick church. Parsonage next door. And they got lots of kids. We're having a picnic. In the middle of the friggin' fields, soybean in the cornfields. When people are determined, how about that silo for a staircase? When people are determined to put your minds together. Almost in Ohio. It's Sunday, good day to go to your temple and you prefer, or Saturday, or whatever day it is. God is good. God is great. Thank you for these peanuts on our plate. <laughs> Sorry. I'm not a very good rhymer or poet. Traveling along, heading to Salina, Ohio. Taking the country roads. America in my Chevrolet. <laughs>